Nadal testimony today in a Fort Hood courtroom. Witnesses coming face to face with Major Nadal Hassan for the first time since the day of the attack that killed 13 and wounded 32 others. KX against Jared Wise has more. And he saw Hassan and locked eyes. Courtroom artist Pat Fuller describes the feeling in the courtroom as the first witness took the stand. It was the first time Sergeant Alonzo Lunsford saw Hassan since the day of the shooting. They locked eyes for probably a good 30 seconds. Really. Intense. Lunsford recounted the events that morning in the medical clinic, saying, When I stand up, Major Hassan and I establish contact. At that time, he brings the weapon up and pointed it at me, and the laser pointed at me. I closed my eyes, and he discharged the weapon. The prosecutor said, What happened? Lunsford said, I got hit in the head. I spinned around and dropped. Lunsford was shot five times that day and had to go through extensive reconstructive surgery. Oh, this is a rare moment. You rarely see this. When you have a victim who survived such trauma, stare at the, the guy who tried to murder him. And, you know, <laughs> neither one of them blinked. Michelle Harper was next on the stand. She worked in the clinic. And while she wasn't injured in the attack, her 911 call was played inside the courtroom. She described the scene to the dispatcher while hiding under a desk. You could feel... Everyone stopped breathing. It was, it was very, very difficult, very difficult. You could hear people dying in the background. It was difficult. Hassan remained silent and emotionless during the testimony today, still in army fatigues and a knit cap. His health is still an ongoing issue, and the court judge warned several breaks and lengthy recesses may be necessary. In Fort Hood, Jared Wise, KXN, Austin News.